In today's tech tip, I'll be showing you how to factory reset your Mac computer. Now, if you're using one of these newer computers with the latest Mac OS version, then it's very simple. All you have to do is go to the Apple logo in the top left corner, click on it, and then select System Preferences, and then go back to the top left corner and click on System Preferences, and then select Erase All Content and Data and Settings, I mean. And then from there, you can just follow the on-screen instructions to factory reset your Mac. But if you're using one of these older Macs, especially if you don't see what I'm talking about, then you're probably using one of the older Macs and Mac OS versions. And so if you're one of those, then here's how to factory reset your own Mac. So the first thing you want to do is sign out of your iCloud account. To do that, click on the Apple logo in the top left corner and select system settings or system preferences, depending on what, uh, which Mac OS version you're using. And then you want to go to general or rather just go to Apple ID And then under Apple ID, click on sign out. And that's going to sign you out of your Apple ID from this Mac. Now, before you perform any kind of factory reset, just make sure you've backed up all the important data. If you have photos and videos, documents, stuff like that, make sure everything is backed up before you begin this process because this is going to literally erase all your user content from the PC or rather from the Mac. Once you're signed out, then let's go ahead and erase the disk. So you want to restart your Mac in recovery mode. And to do that, just go and click on the Apple logo in the top left corner and then restart your Mac. And as soon as you hear the restart sound, you want to press command and R on your keyboard and you want to hold these two buttons until you go to the recovery screen. So just be ready, command and R on your keyboard. So the screen will go black. Let's wait for the sound. There you go. As soon as you hear that sound, hold command and R. Just keep holding those two buttons until the mark starts in recovery mode. And as soon as you see the Mac OS recovery, you can now let go. And now we are inside recovery mode. So here, what you want to do is go to disk utility, click on that, and then click on continue. And then you should see your Mac OS uh, base system. So go up there and click on Macintosh HD. And once you click on it, you can now go ahead and click on Erase. Then of course it's going to ask you, make sure the format is APFS and then click on Erase. Do not change the format that's there. Just leave it the way it is, just click on Erase. So it might take some time to erase all your data depending on how much data you had on your Mac. So just be patient and allow it to do its thing. So once it's done, just click on done. And now everything has been erased. If you had other volumes like this one, then you can also go ahead and erase them. Okay. So just make sure both of these are erased. Once that's done, you can now close this and that will take you back to the utility menu. From where you just have to click on reinstall Mac OS and then click on continue. So from here, click on continue and it's going to begin the reinstallation process. And then by the time you're done, of course you're going to follow some prompts and you're going to just follow the on-screen instructions to reinstall Mac OS. And by the time you're done, you'll have factory reset your Mac computer.
it's really that simple. Thanks for watching, leave your comments and questions down below and good luck.